I'm here representing the, the clinical commissioning group and uh, it's a starting point in terms of engagement with, with the local population about the future services at Castleberg Hospital. The clinical commissioning group um, is an organisation that plans and buys and then monitors the healthcare for uh, the local population in Airedale, Wharfdale and Craven. So in the past few months Castleberg Hospital has had to temporarily shut. Um, Airedale Foundation Hospital Trust, uh, which runs the services from Castleberg Hospital, took the, took the decision to have to withdraw the services from the hospital. And this was because um, of, of the issues they were having with plumbing, electricity and the sewage at, at the hospital there. And it, it became clear that it was no longer safe to care for patients in the hospital and for the staff to work at the hospital there. So what this ha has done is, is given us opportunity now to look at how best to use the resource and, and, and to also go to the public and, and ask how best should we use it? Yeah. What are our health and care needs? Uh, because there are big implications uh, going forward with, with funding uh, in the whole of healthcare, but lo 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 locally in terms of uh, Castleberg Hospital, it's not about shutting the hospital, it's about how best to use resource in, in our area to meet the patients and our population's health and care needs. Now uh, they're being cared for in, in, in the community. Um, now Airedale Foundation Hospital have, have strengthened the community teams and that involves the, the district nurses, the healthcare assistants uh, in, in, in those teams there. They strengthen them with the staff from Castleberg Hospital uh, and the resource there and, and that's enabled again to, to where appropriate to have patients at home uh, and wrap the care around them but if they're not safe at home then to be admitted to a, a care home whether that's residential or nursing home in, in, the, in the local area uh, to, again to ensure that they're safe and they get the right care uh, in, in relatively familiar uh, surroundings. It's not about long-term care, it's, it's more really about the safety during an episode where they don't need to they have an acute medical episode or it might be a, a, a kind of social need for, for, for a short period of time, but they do need some care and, and, and in order to make sure that's safe, uh, they get admitted temporarily to, to a care home with the aim to get home into their own familiar surroundings with the, with the right care package. I think people do want to be at home, uh, they want to be in familiar surroundings, but yes, they want to make sure they have the right care uh, and the right place and they get it at the right time. And I think we've appropriately assessed, uh, and so where it's deemed that someone isn't too ill, uh, that they should be able to stay at home or stay in familiar surroundings, not just for themselves as patients, but their relatives who want to visit them relatives who want to see them uh, pop in at times that they want to pop in in they can do that when they're at home or in, or in care homes there uh, i mean in hospitals it's a little bit harder to do that it's either the travel or, or there's visiting times and so it's not as easy and, if, and, and i think patients do want to be at home where they can be but we've got to be safe as well well in, in this initial phase what, what we want to find out is, is what is important for the individuals health and care in this area um, there so we want to that's one question we want, want to be asking we also want to be asking about how we should consult, uh, really, and, and, and how people want us to engage with them. So we can understand everyone's opinions. We're not here just to hear one person's or one, one view. It's, you know, it's important we, get, we understand everyone's view as, as much as possible. So engagement and, and, and participation of, of, of pa patients and, and people within the, within the lo location is important there. You know, there are options on the table, uh, and, but nothing has been decided on at this point, and that's part of the consultation process process. One of the options may be to keep Castleberg open uh, and that, that's, on, that's on the table there. But there are other options like d d uh, using the, the resource in, in a different way, uh, wrapping that care around the patient at home or in, in, a, in a care home there. It may be using a different facility, using resource in, in a different facility in, in, in the locality as well. Uh, and there may be other options that people may want to bring to the table as well that we'll, we'll listen to and, and, and understand. It is important to say that we're, we're, no options ha have been discounted uh, and part of this phase is about consulting with uh, people in, in, in the localities and, and understand what their, their health and care needs are and then perhaps how we go forward with these and what they, what they feel about these, these options and all other options.